I get those goosebumps every time I need the hymn Throw that to the side, yo I get those goosebumps every time, yeah Greetings technicians, this is Admin Crow here, your coach of the Toronto Star Raptors, bringing you the team builder for another week in the PCL, the Pokemon Champions League. This is season 3, week 10, and we are taking on one of our good friend Lo-Fi. Uh, he is the other Torontonian coach in the league, and uh, we have been helping each other with marking and team prepping throughout the season, and uh, also the entirety of last season pretty much as well. Uh, I, I helped him... Uh, got his hands on the uh, championship from season 2 and uh, for this season he isn't doing so hard because he's trying to meme it up by drafting a mono generation uh, team uh, I believe his team is mono gen 1 and plus on top of that his record isn't so great he, he is actually guaranteed out of the playoffs and with the W that the Raptors picked up from last week we are guaranteed the number one seed uh, from our division if, uh, if we're not, uh, if I'm not mistaken, uh, going into playoffs um, guaranteed. So for this week, we're just tr gonna try to meme it up a little bit. So how we did the uh, teams, or I guess um, how how we build the teams for this week, right? Uh, we gave each other three of our monsters that we're bringing, and plus on top of that, um, we get uh, we get to basically make each half of uh, the other person's team for them. Um, so the three months I gave it to him were uh, Trevenant, Tyranitar, and Nihiligo. Obviously, I have to bring low fight Trevenant, uh, Trevenant against him, right? And it's only appropriate for this time of the year. <laughs> if you guys didn't know, this uh, video should be going up the weekend before Halloween. And uh, yeah, it, it's basically the most appropriate month for this week as well. Uh, so with... Um, the sets that he gave me, we are allowed to change the EVs and the items and up to one move on the move set, but we are not allowed to change the ability. Obviously, um, obviously there are three great abilities I can run on Trevenant, but on the other two months, not so much. Uh, so the the set he initially gave me was <laughs> Rest. Uh, Woodhammer, I think it was Phantom Force and Leech Seed and uh, with Lumberry Harvest, straight up uh, Lumberry Harvest, not even Natural Cure <laughs> yeah um, so the idea was to be able to rest and then uh, uh, come, come wake myself up with Lumberry and be able to harvest off the berry <laughs> uh, I think he gave me like a specially defensive variant as well I made it more physically bulky because I am packing uh, a Salvest Tita, as you guys will see a little bit, uh, with a careful nature, and uh, I just put a whole bunch of random EV spread <laughs> because I wasn't allowed to change the nature, so I just changed the, I just made the EVs uh, more physically defensive. Um, and uh, up next, we do have a narrow Tyranitar. Yeah, I, I really don't have anything to say about this set. It's usable, I guess. Um, anyways, uh, uh, so up next, we have Nero Tyranitar packing the Assault Vest. Initially, I think he had weakness policy with a rock polish and three attacks. Um, but I changed Rock Polish to Ancient Power to get that nice stat from the special side. Uh, 95 special attack not even bad with the Assault Vest uh, was my item of choice. And I did make it a little bit more uh, specially, or I guess especially bulky on top of the uh, special attack. He gave me a Modest Nature, I wasn't allowed to change that. Uh, but I did give uh, it a little bit more speed. I think that was to speed creep the uh, Clefable in, in case he wants to s speed creep. Uh, my Titar, I think Clefable has 60 speed, I could be wrong. Uh, but um, up next, we do have uh, uh, Nihiligo, uh, Nova Nihiligo packing a light clay. Uh, this set I didn't change too much. Uh, the moves I actually kept it was dual screen plus uh, surge wave and power jam, uh, which pretty much hits the entirety of his roster, anyways. Um, and uh, I actually made a mistake here. So initially, he had a lot less uh, special attack with this uh, spread. Um, so I thought I was getting a speed boost, right? So I made my special attack higher than my speed <laughs> during like before the game and then I didn't realize my special defense was higher than my special attack. <laughs> so if I were to get a speed boost, I'm gonna be getting a special defense uh, speed boost, which was the, uh, uh, sorry, special defense boost, not special defense speed boost. Um, I don't know what I'm saying, but um, yeah, I'll be getting a special defense boost over a special attack boost if I were to trigger my beast boost. 
Um, so we will see how that comes into play in the actual game. And uh, for the uh, battle itself, it is a live com this week, so you guys will get to see my <laughs> reaction. <laughs> and uh, we'll, we'll uh, go over it in the chat. So it's it's a really fun game, and I hope you guys uh, stay around for that. And up next uh, are the three mods that I brought uh, this week. He does have a Materium Z, that's why I wanted something to check his uh, bulky water, especially the uh, um, slow bro. Uh, that's why we have uh, charted the uh, Galventula here, pa packing a choice back. I really don't need a choice back to blow back his uh, three water types, uh, slow bro, cloister, and uh, Gyarados. Um, with the ability compound eyes, uh, nice spec with uh, webs, uh, hidden power eyes for his uh, Nido King primarily, and his uh, Rhydon. I guess um, I didn't have energy ball because I didn't have. Th to be honest, I didn't put too much effort in prepping this team, and I was trying to meme it up a little bit too. That's why I had a choice back sticky web, as well. Um, his team is already extremely slow, so I don't. I really didn't need the sticky web uh, to be, you know, to be fast. To be honest, anyways. Um, but uh, I I wanted uh, my Tarana to put in work um, under webs so I can outspeed a few things. A voice switch for momentum, thunder just for damage um, against these water types. Uh, I didn't need a bug coverage because uh, the electric type uh, coverage hits the slow bro anyways. Um, and just a modest nature, enough speed to outspeed the Arcanine, which is actually the uh, fastest thing on his roster. I think that was for Arcanine? I'm not sure. It looks like it's for Arcanine, right? <laughs> anyways, <laughs> or, or, or it might be for Tim and Nidoking, I'm not sure. Uh, I think this was for Arcanine. This speed was for Arcanine. This was for Tim and Nidoking, I'm pretty sure. Uh, because the the next fastest thing on his roster is him on Lee, and if he brings the fast him on Lee, right, it's probably going to be unburdened anyways to outspeed uh, my mons. So I wasn't going to outspeed the unburdened him on Lee, so the next benchmark will be a Tim and Nidoking. Mm -hmm. I think that's what I set the speed for, I think. Question mark. Anyways, uh, we do have Winter Junior here, Gligar, packing nice choice scarf, right? With the ability Hyper Carter just for that Arcanine and Gyarados Intimidate. Uh, nice uh, scarf <laughs> defog and U-turn, knock off an EQ. Nice uh, mini Lando T here without Intimidate, <laughs> with 75 <laughs> attack uh, and Adam and Nature. I did the uh, EV this thing to outspeed a uh, timid, um, timid, um, I think it's Magneton was the thing that I set it for. To be honest, this set is pretty bad. I couldn't touch a lot of uh, flying types on his team because my primary uh, way of dishing damage is Earthquake. Um, so we'll, we'll see how that turns out. Nice uh, Scarf U-turn with Defog. Um, so up next we do have uh, Genesis, the Volcarona, packing the Fear and Z and the ability Flame Body. Uh, the only This set is relatively standard. It's just a uh, Quiver Dance, Bug Buzz, Overheat, and Roost. Uh, the EV spreads. I literally just used the one off smoke gun. I, d <laughs> I did not. Um, I did not uh, speed creep anything. I don't even know what the speed is for. <laughs> um, was a bold nature. Uh, I literally just brought this set uh, simply because I never got off Furion Z fire move with Volcarona like at all this season. So <laughs> I want to try to uh, get that out of the way this time. Hopefully. Um, so yeah, that's basically the, uh, the team. I didn't really have uh, too much to say this time around. It's mainly supposed to be a fun match against one of my good pals. And uh, since he's already uh, for sure out of playoffs and we are guaranteed a playoff spot with the number one seat uh, within our division. So I wasn't uh, as concerned. I was just, just trying to have fun with him. Um, so yeah, let's, uh, let's see how the battle goes down. Um, Maybe later today or tomorrow, and uh, you guys be sure be sure to check out that video. Uh, I I do have some interesting reactions, uh, to say the least. So, anyways, this is gonna be it from me this week. Uh, this is gonna uh, this is going to be Admin Crow here signing off. See you guys next time. Goodbye, technicians.